in lesson 201 on data visualization with Tableau will create a dashboard. So we will go into Tableau. We have three worksheets, worksheet one, worksheet two, worksheet three. We'll bring all of them into the dashboard. So let's create a new dashboard and bring uh, sheet one into the dashboard and dashboard can have before we do that dashboard can have two vertical boxes or two horizontal boxes and so on but we would like to create a dashboard that is more flexible so to do that we'll need to uh, float these structures each of them and then this one float and then we have one more float so we have a dashboard we have the graph would like to use instead of a standard would like to use entire view and for device preview would like to go with default and then for size instead of fixed size we'll go automatic so that way it will cover the whole area so now for us uh, since we have to bring in other ones so we'd like to make it little bit shorter so let's say on this side we cover the whole area and we have this order date make it transparent so it comes into the front the customer segment same thing bring into the front And then region, same thing, floating order, bring to front. So now let's also have a title for this dashboard and let's call it, okay, let's uh, call it uh, dashboard for map and bar charts make it bold make it centered apply okay also I would like to have this floating so that way I can put wherever I want so now we are going to rearrange this. Uh, let's bring this up there. Mm, let me put some space in between. Maybe one less. Let's see. Okay. And we are going to put them there and customer segment can be smaller and region can be a little bit smaller so let me see so once we do that then we can bring in sheet number two place it in here same thing 
we basically have to float them to make that more nice looking we have to do the same thing with the filters also otherwise they take up too much space uh, this one floating bring it over here and then we have one more left and this floating and we bring it down there and we also would like to rearrange them and make it look nicer so once we do that it takes a little while so i'll be rearranging them and setting it up and i will show you what the resulting dashboard looks like after rearranging them a little bit you can see that the dashboard it can be a nice looking arrangements of graphs and other stuff so here we could usually use the same that we did in the chart so we can look at a specific region or we could look at different time horizon or we could look at over here uh, a specific region in the bar chart so it's basically the same idea the interesting thing is that now we have more information in one slide so usually one dashboard has one or more slides sheets together and then putting together several dashboard can create a presentation usually known as a storybook so this is all we have for today in terms of creating a dashboard next dashboard we will put together two other slides two other sheets two other graphs that we created and we'll create another another dashboard with those two so thanks for watching uh, i'll see you on the next presentation bye now